Hello there and welcome to another one of our Lexical Lab One Minute English videos. If you like this video, make sure you subscribe to our YouTube channel and check out our website www.lexicallab.com for the new bunch of English language courses we're currently offering online. At the moment, we are in week who the hell knows what of the third lockdown here in North London. Um, like a lot of people, I've been finding this particular lockdown the hardest of the three that we've had here in the UK. Partly because it just seems crazy that we're still in lockdown almost a year after the virus first arrived here. Um, the death rates are still quite high. Government still seems to be making it up as it goes along. And partly I think it's because we're homeschooling, the weather is terrible, it's grey and cold and wet out there. So it's really getting me down at the moment, this lockdown. I was chatting to a friend of mine in Russia the other day, and she was telling me that the lockdown rules there are far more flexible than they are here. For better or worse you decide whether you think that's a good thing or not. But she was saying that there's a lot more leeway there and people are freer to interpret the rules and regulations in their own way. If you say there's a lot more leeway, it means that people have a lot more individual freedom to take action or to make decisions. In the same way, um, the government might introduce new rules to give local councils or small businesses more leeway in terms of the way they do things. And if you've got kids, you will know that when they start to get to like 11 or 12 years old and they start wanting a bit more independence, you need to give them a bit more leeway and let them make their own decisions a bit more. If you have enjoyed this video, make sure you click the like button, share it with your friends, and as always, in the comment section below, let us know how you think you might use the word leeway.